pay a thousand dollars, okay, to blow up the fish, plus fifteen percent popularity for the next day. Why in anybody's right mind would want to pay a thousand dollars? First of all, like you would think they make that free, but why would you pay a thousand dollars to blow up the fish? And my second question is. Why would that get you plus 15% popularity for the next day? Hello everyone, welcome back to another Let's Build a Zoo video, and it's been quite a while. The last time I made a Let's Build a Zoo video, it was like during the Aquarium DLC release, which was 2-3 months ago maybe? I'm not sure, but anyways, the first thing I noticed is that we have a task complete, so that's 2k right there. I'm gonna quickly pause the game, oh my gosh. I almost forgot how to pause the game, it's been so long. New Aquatic Animal. The fishing boat has discovered a new aquatic animal from the ocean today. That's fantastic. Anyways, like I said, it's been quite a while since I've played this game. So I figured why not get back into it and go back to our aquarium. So what do we have going on here since the last episode? Because I can't really remember too well. So we have this nicely decorated enclosure right here. It looks like their feeding is not very good. But anyways, we have... Ah yes, the starfish that live so long, so, so long. We have a 59-year-old in this tank. Anyways, we have starfish, clownfish, seahorses, and surgeonfish, no, blue tanks in here. I really thought they were called surgeonfish. I don't know if that's just me, though. But that's that tank, and then over here we have ourselves some pufferfish, which I think might actually be able to go in that enclosure. Can they not? I can't really, I don't know. I guess they can't? But anyways, yes, we have two tanks. Uh, how much money do we have? 8500 ish That's nice. And it looks like we have some research points. Let's just get straight there. Okay, so in the research tab, it looks like we've done a little bit. We've gotten the reef enclosure. But I'm thinking we should get the open ocean enclosure. Just so we're prepared in case we get any fish that are like that. What is this? Another decoration pack? Okay. So let's, let's do this. Enclosures. So there's a new enclosure thing here. It, which is enrichment pack, rubber ducks. Well, rubber ducks are a necessity, so we're going to get those. Signboard pack instructions. No, we're not going to get that. Um, Is there anything really necessary? I guess we could get a subway, but I don't find that to be, like, you know, something we have to do right now. Oh, cold waters enclosure. We're going to get that. Okay, we have zero credit points or research points or whatever. It's been so long since I've played this game. Terrarium store. I think we're going to save up for that next. Or maybe the new bus. I'm not sure. But anyways, out of that, we have a new task from Mr. Toy. Terrarium design. He wants us to build a terrarium store. So we will start working on unlocking that. And now we have other tasks as well. Own at least four mini buses. If I go to transport. Okay, so we only have one bus right now. Right here. Order more. How much do they cost? Two thousand so to complete that task it's gonna be uh six thousand dollars okay let's get one for now in that new area so now we have them coming from these two places starfish cave and lakeside i think that says cove actually anyways enough yapping about this aquarium and everything and what we did in the last episode let's go to the world map and see what we have here i think this is the good fishing boat yes it is but they're only fish that we have. So sadly, we're not going to do that. If we go to the evil one, they have the Mahi Mahi, which is brand new. But obviously, we are not going to get fish from the evil boat because we are not evil. We have a morality of 10 points, and we're going to keep it like that. So we're going to play the game, let things happen, and what's up in the CRISPR splicer? Anything we can do? Select DNA pair. There's the four fish we have unlocked. Super cool fish up and coming. Hopefully we get some cool ones. What is this black bus? Don't they drop off like evil people in like business suits and stuff? Who are you? Who are you? It doesn't look like they're evil. That's good. Uh, we have the other buses as well. Anyways, if we go to morality. Oh, critical choice. Let me help. Buy a bus using credit. So take a loan of $2,500 and get a bus instantly, or reject the officer. The officer? Offer. 
I think you can grow your business if you have more buses. I know that they cost a lot, so how much, how, what is going on today? So how about I lend you the money? I can give you the money right now. Yes, there is some profit in there for me, but it's really worthwhile for you, I think. Well, personally, I really don't think that's necessary right now. I don't like taking loans because I don't like having something that I know I have to pay for over time. So I'm going to reject humbly. I'm going to humbly reject that offer a long son. So goodbye. And anyways, back to our morality. So animals, we have very good morality. People, we have good morality. Neutral. Some neutrals in there. Uh, business, good. And pollution, we will be evil once pollution is unlocked. So, we have some shops, but what else can we build? Obviously, we have the five tanks, the two new ones we just got, and some new ones from research that we can eventually unlock. Going to the shops, we could get a tropical juice. Do we have one of these yet? I don't think so, so I'm going to go ahead and place it, like, right here, I think. And, yeah, that's fine. Higher. And now we have another thing there. Is there an ATM here? That is a good question, and I don't think there is, but I'm not totally sure where to get them. So if I look around, no, I'm not seeing any. Decoration, light, bench, farm, factories, water, staff entrances, attractions, shop, facilities, maybe? Amenities? Um, I'm not seeing it. Uh, I, facilities? No, shop? No. Yeah, I'm not sure how to get ATMs. I'm very sorry about that. What is this in this enclosure? Is that, like, dirty, like, poop or something? I can't really tell, but... Hopefully somebody cleans that soon. I'm not really sure what the staffing's like. We should actually probably check that. We are searching for janitors. And we only have one fish keeper. So can we recruit more? I, I guess we might as well just start uh, searching for them. What are these? Benches. Why do we need benches? Okay. Let me build a bench then. Right here. Ooh, that's a cool bench right there. I'm going to place it... Oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't know. I, uh, this is a very... Okay, I think what I need to do is I need to expand this path. So what pathway are we using right now? Bluestone. Okay. Oh, I forgot you can't, like, quick click and drag. You have to, like, go through it like this. Okay. And that's done. And now I kind of want to just, like, get a path going up here. Finish that off. And that's looking mighty fine, if I do say so myself. And then we can go ahead and get some, like, benches around here. And there's a lot of congestion here, so I don't think we're going to place one there. How do I rotate? R? No. Scroll? No, that zooms out. Oh, no. How do I rotate? Z? X? R. I already tried that. Um. Okay, well, I do not know how to rotate. Um. That's okay. Maybe you can't rotate in this game. Wait, yes you can. I don't know. It's fine. We'll keep those benches for now. Oh, uh, we already have benches. Trash. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Uh, build a bin, I guess. Where? Amenities. Green bin. Sure. I'll place one right here. And it looks like it's the end of the day because everybody is rushing out of our aquarium. Fantastic. No, don't destroy anything. Okay, the game is saving and... Wait, get first fish from either boat, first catch. I don't know what that's all about. Anyways, the game is saving. We have a new task. I'm not going to read all that. I'm just going to see what the task is. Own 10 hybrid fish? What's it mean by that? And also, what is that fish? It's it, it's good morality, so it's in the good boat, so we can get it. But that looks weird. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling because I've been rambling for so long. Only important moments now. And this is an important moment. We have to go see what that fish is. So the good boat's up here today. A sea urchin. What habitat is that? And also, like, what are they like? Like, are they going to kill our fish or something? Okay, let's go see that aquarium first. That, like, I think it's a coastal aquarium. So it's just like all the other ones. I think we'll make another one. Another tank. And we have a critical choice. Well, I think I'm going to do the good choice. Because I want good morality. So we're going to donate $1,000 to help the ocean graphy community go ahead and we're going to expand this i don't know one two three four five six that's enough for a sea urchin right two three four five six 
That's plenty for a sea urchin. I mean, sea urchins are small, I think. And also, these two enclosures are reefs. They're not coastal. I thought they were. Does anyone clean this place? Honestly, I don't know. Anyways, back to the world map. Let's get this sea urchin. We have it now. And we're going to place it in here. And it's arriving in one day. So we're just going to speed up the time. And I'll let you know if anything happens. Actually, we should probably get a janitor. So I'm going to go to the park staff and search these applicants. View all of them. And they all really suck. I guess we're going to get Emerson. Sure. Hire. Uh, no. Okay. Back to speeding up time and let you guys know if anything interesting happens. Oh, shoot. One more thing. One more thing. I know this isn't too interesting to many people, but we can go to research and get the terrarium store, which will complete one of our tasks. And now that we have the terrarium store, let's go to build mode. Uh, facilities, amenities. Yeah, terrarium store. That looks so cool. Task complete, $1,000. Have at least one bacteria farm in your zoo. Right. And we're going to hire that person, because why not? And, yeah, back to speeding up time, and I'll let you guys know if anything happens once again. Okay, guys, the sea urchin should be flying in right about now. Yep, there it is. Let's take a look. And, yeah, it's just like the picture showed. It's just a sea urchin. And, oh my gosh, this is just like the starfish. It's 79 days old, and it's not even halfway through its life. This guy is going to get old. Coastal enclosure, enclosure capacity, it's spacious, of course. And it looks like their ideal living conditions are coastal. So they do like it. So, thankfully, this enclosure is perfect for them. Or, I shouldn't say them, I should say it. It's only one. Oh no, guys. There's a new aquatic animal, but it's in the evil boat, and it looks like an octopus. And my vision also just got covered up because of another critical choice. I'm not going to do the evil choice, so I don't even care what it says. To the world map, I feel so bad. For this octopus why does it have to be in the evil boat why couldn't the good boat have found them also we're gonna grab this sea urchin because our sea urchin needs a friend but i'm sad i really want an octopus that'd be so cool for our aquarium oh my gosh guys we almost have ten thousand dollars i wonder how much it costs to expand the land i think i would have to expand it this way though so how much does it cost only a thousand Okay, good to know for the future, but we really don't need much space right now. Unlock one fishing boat upgrade. How do I do that? Is that in the research hub? Maybe. If I scroll a bit. Fishing boat. It looks like we have something here for the fishing boat. So let's go ahead and buy a plant pack and a fishing boat upgrade, which costs seven research points, and we have six. So that's what we'll save up for, but it looks like it's the end of the day, so that research kind of go by really fast right about now i would say right about now i would say yep there we go saving game blah 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 i don't really care oh my gosh guys is that a sunfish right now in the good boat oh i I'm, we're getting the sunfish of course let me go back to the research hub really quick and get the fishing boat upgrade and now that we have it we have uh, gotten a thousand dollars or whatever but guys that was a sunfish and also, we got another sea urchin just then. Where's the good boat? Right here. Sunfish. 28. The open sea enclosure. So let's quickly make one of those. And I'm thinking we're going to put it here. Because open, like, water or whatever. That means they're going to need a lot of space. So we're going to get it. What's going on? Why can't I? Why can't I? Hold on. Let me go here. What? Why? I'm confused. Why can't I place? Why can't I place this? I'm so confused. Why can't I? What? What is happening? It's a new day, there's two new aquatic animals in the evil boat, so obviously we're not going to go for it. But what is happening? Why can't I... I can only place it at these pecs? Different enclosures are more suitable for certain animals. Try to build the ideal habitat for your animals. I'm trying to, but if I place this... 
it's saying I have to attach it here and then here I can't attach it down here though why why is that hold on if I place this here and I go up to here and then here here okay there's an enclosure right there so now if I click it and edit enclosure and I change the shape why why am I being forced to do these like little pecs here why can't I just shape it how I want it to be I'm very confused but anyways we do have that enclosure here so if we go to the good boat no that's the evil boat I was so confused wait what where the sunfish go oh my gosh I waited too long worrying about the dumb in in enclosures like not working that the sunfish got lost like I can't get it anymore because it, it because there was like a new day that sucks how old is our sea urchins 82 and 32 right oh uh, are they both okay saving game okay is is the sunfish back in the good boat no it's not no that is actually upsetting I Okay, critical choice. Invest one thousand dollars for an ocean beer cooling rod. I, I guess that's the good option. Anyways, I'm just gonna wait it out and hope we get the sunfish again because I worked, I worked a lot to make this aqu aquarium enclosure thing that like was being very uh, testy. I don't know what to say. So I, I need to get the sunfish in this episode. While we wait, I guess we might as well do something useful and start doing this. Research pack plus one researcher, of course. Animal enrichment, floaties, stuff like that. I think I'm going to get, I don't know, um, not surveillance, a uh, plant pack and tree pack. Why not? Now that we can get a new researcher, let's go to park staff. And start searching for a researcher because once we get a researcher, just just one more, our research is going to be doubled and we are going to get research done so much faster. End of week summary, utilities didn't work out so well. Trash wasn't that good. Income was extremely good. Expenditure, which I'm actually not sure what, what that means. Is that like what we spent maybe? Well, that's really good. Loan repayment, there are no loans, thankfully. Salary payments, over a thousand. That's a lot of salaries. Gas emissions. It's not really... Oh, $1,563, I think. And 84 I don't know. But anyways, that's not too bad. We're making money. Saving game, of course. New aquatic animal. But is the sunfish back? No. Critical choice. Pay $1,000 to blow up the fish. What? What? what pay a thousand dollars okay to blow up the fish plus 15 percent popularity for the next day why in anybody's right mind would want to pay a thousand dollars first of all like you would think they make that free but why would you pay a thousand dollars to blow up the fish and my second question is why would that get you plus 15% popularity for the next day? I'm so confused, but we're going to humbly reject that offer. Guys, new aquatic animals. The sunfish is back in the boat. Let's hurry up and get there before it leaves. Here's the good boat right here. Sunfish, rescue instantly. We have the sunfish for only $28. It's going in this tank, and it is really big. The tank is almost not big enough, but for some reason, I can't expand the tank, or can I? Change shape. And apparently, I can only make it go, oh, I could do that, and then that, and then that, and that, and connect. Oh, crap. Okay, there we go. That's a better size tank for a sunfish, and hopefully other giant open water fish as well. I don't know what it is about this game, but I just love it so much. It's so much fun looking at all the fish move around, the animals in the regular game move around, the dinosaurs in the other DLC. This game is just so underrated and so much fun. I love it so much. There's so many things you can do. There's a park rating, money of course, saving game of course, because it does that every night. And oh my gosh guys, the new boat has a new fish, the Mahi Mahi. Sadly we can't get a lionfish or, oh no, a turtle. 
Okay, sunfish is coming in. Hold on. We have to pause everything. Whoa. That thing is massive. We're going to play the game normally. This this guy is huge. Wow. Okay, we're going to go to the world map. And the good boat's down here. So we have the Mahi Mahi. We're going to rescue it. Take it to the ocean. Oh, ocean. The open water enclosure. And place it in here, even though it's not letting me. Yep, use that. And now, I am going to wait for the Mahi Mahi to come in. We're going to see if the Mahi Mahi and the Sunfish are friends. And if they are, the video is going to end. If they aren't, well, then we'll just quickly make another tank for the Mahi Mahi. And then the video will end. We'll find out, but let me speed up time to make it go quicker. Oh my goodness, guys. There's another Sunfish. We are going to rescue it. We're going to put it in this tank. And the Mahi Mahi is going to arrive in two hours, so we're going to see if the Sunfish and the Mahi Mahi get along here very soon. In fact, very soon, as in, in, it should start counting down minutes any time now. Yes, 20, 10, 4, 2, inbound. Here it comes, and as soon as it comes in, the game's going back into regular mode to make sure that these guys get along. So here's the Mahi Mahi. Here's the Mahi Mahi. Oh my gosh, it's a lot bigger than I thought it was. Okay. No threat for... Nope, nope. Oh my gosh. What's happening? Okay. So the sunfish says there's no threat. But the reason I just got terrified was because I swore the Mahi Mahi was coming in to kill the sunfish. But let's find out. Oh. Okay, it's just a fast swimmer. It's just really enjoy swimming and stuff, you know? They're just having fun. They're just swimming together. They're they're having a blast. I hear a baby was born. Holy crap, you're right. Look at this tank, guys. When we started this video, there were like three seahorses and two clownfish. This is crazy. There's even a baby clownfish right here. That's adorable. Are, are they doing good on space? They are. Okay, well, anyways, I'm going to pause the game here. And if I had to choose which enclosure my favorite is, I feel like it's the open water one just because of how big the fish are. Oh, I love it. I love how cool these fish are. Mahi Mahi, I, I never even heard of. Maybe once in like Octonauts or something. Some fish I did hear of, of course, because of recent Minecraft videos and stuff. But anyways, I'm going to end the video here. This right here is going to be the thumbnail, of course. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. I so, so appreciate it. And if you did make it this far, which I highly doubt, but if you did make it this far, I assume that you enjoy my Let's Build a Zoo videos, unless you just like skip to the end to just hear the outro or something. But I don't know. I don't really see many people doing it. So if you made it to the end of this video, I know that you enjoy this series, or I know that you at least enjoyed the background noise of the series while you were doing homework or something. I don't know. But nonetheless, you watched the entire video, which means you're probably interested in Let's Build a Zoo. So I'm going to ask you right now, and only you, because you're probably the only one who made it to the end if you are here right now. So I'm going to ask you, should I continue my dinosaur series in Let's Build a Zoo? Because I do still have that zoo, and it's going really well. I'm on like day 99 or something, out of like 5 episodes I think. So if you want to see me continue that series, and this series, let me know in the comments down below. Comment, I don't know, hashtag fish if you want to see the dinosaur series come back and i know that's weird but you know hashtag fish if you made it to the end if you're seeing this part right now and i'll see you in the next one peace out and thanks a lot